So yesterday I made an Outer Wilds joke about this scientific study, evidence of negative time found in quantum physics experiment. And I said I would break down the actual science after, you know, the joke had run its course. This comes out of the University of Toronto. It was a team of researchers led by Daniela Angulo. They were doing an experiment where they were shooting photons into super cool rubidium atoms. Why? Because basically the atoms would absorb those photons and then emit them. When an atom absorbs a photon, it enters a high energy state, and when it emits it, it enters a low energy state. And they were essentially measuring the time period between when the atom enters that low energy state and the photon gets emitted. And they found two little bits of quantum weirdness. Number one, sometimes a photon would pass through the cloud of rubidium atoms as if it had interacted with nothing, and yet some atoms would be excited. And two, sometimes they would find that a photon would be emitted from an atom before it entered its low energy state. And because entering the low energy state is what emits the photon, there's some quantum weirdness happening there. The paper has been uploaded to archive and it hasn't been peer reviewed yet. So quantumly weird, yes, time travel, it isn't. But this Scientific American headline just reminded me so much of the Outer Wilds that I had to make the joke. And for everybody on my previous video who didn't get the joke, go play Outer Wilds. It's one of the best video games I've ever played.